This is so important for Oklahoma because if we have an abduction, time is, uh, is critical to find that person before harm is done to them. Uh, unfortunately, in 2007, uh, Kelsey Smith was abducted. She was 18 years of age, abducted in Kansas, and four days later, her body was found. And uh, uh, since then, uh, several states have passed this law that says, look, if you're a carrier or a provider, uh, AT&T or one of those type of companies, you can actually give this information to law enforcement in, in these emergency situations. So we think this bill will save lives in Oklahoma. And you have tightened the bill up or added some new language since it was first introduced? Absolutely. We want to make sure that it's not the, the public's information that's given out. It's just that carrier so they can get a hold of them uh, during these crises. And secondly, we put a notification on there. So within 30 days, the carrier will have to provide notif notification that they did ping this phone. So it just gives another safeguard for our citizens. And you said overall Oklahoma carriers have been cooperative, but this allows consistency and protection for them? Absolutely. Uh, they have cooperated in the past and looked at these things. Obviously, it doesn't happen often, and we're glad that it doesn't. Uh, but what this does is gives them some coverage on their liability, too. They're saying, look, they're just helping law enforcement. It's a legitimate issue. There's an emergency out there, and we're going to help law enforcement find this individual.